What is going on guys, DBG here and today it is all star the start of what appears to be all star week in my team lads. So before we get on to it, if you guys are new to the channel, subscribe. We are well, we're at 280k and we're probably gonna be at 280k for quite a while. But anyway, huge thank you guys for all the support on the channel recently and all the support today. So today we know we got one of just the most what I think could have been a cool concept, but 2K ruined it, and I've already gone in depth as to why I think they've ruined it. Um, it could have been a cool concept with celebrity cards. We can't even use these celebrity cards online, so there's honestly just no point in them, is there? There's really no point in them. So we got, the celebrities we got was, we got the Booster, we got Quavo, and uh, we also got um, Ronnie 2K. Ronnie 2K is a, little bit, is a bit fun to use. I do have to admit that, like, Ronnie 2K is very, very fun to use. So, um, and yeah, I'm just kind of, in general, kind of disappointed because, like, you can't use the guys online. But that's something I've already talked about in another video. Now we're going to get on to what was hinted from good old sixth man Sam. So if you guys are not following, like, my team on Twitter, obviously the my team page tweets out a lot of stuff about the game mode. So, um, I have these stuff about... Tweet out Donkey on Ronnie 2K. And I got I gotta give props to Ronnie. He's playing along with the joke. Video dunking on his card. Like Ron Ronnie is very, very self-aware. He plays along with the joke. I gotta give him credit for that. Like again, I don't know the guy. Obviously from the Ronnie 2K persona. Someone who plays the game a lot. Obviously, you're gonna be annoyed at some of the things he says, but I will say he is very, very self-aware. But um Yeah, this is a tweet from Six Man Sam. From six man Sam, more all star content, you say? Question mark. So, um, someone said, "Give me Reggie Lewis and add spotlights." Sam replies, "We need YBC to make his return." Good old Crab D from a uh, the TikTok guy. Oh wow, this guy he I forgot he's the guy who got hold. He's guys played like eleven hundred games to not get Reggie Lewis. Um, the game boosted. I'm interested in Ronnie's stats. Better all-star content to follow with actual players, which is going to happen. Like, considering the fact that we already know all-star packs are going to come out. And Sam, in fairness to Sam, if something's leaked early, he's not going to, like, overhype something for no reason because he hasn't yet. So, could we, could we see spotlights? Could we see spotlights? I don't think so. I really think so. Man, people are pissed. In fairness, though, it is like a 2K devs tweet, so people are always going to be pissed. But um, as you guys can see here, more all-star content. And the fact that he tweeted that today, if this was just all-star packs, and we all know all-star packs are coming, there would be no reason for him to have tweeted it right before. And especially call this all-star content. Like, I know um, Quavo and Ronnie 2K are from the celebrity game, but, like, the game isn't necessarily all-star content. Like, So the fact that they've deemed this all-star content means it's highly likely that we're seeing we see stuff throughout the weekend so this week it's a little bit different because last year remember we had all those all-star packs we had like 12 countdown days to the all-star weekend we just got random all-star player each of the packs you remember we had, had that last year we obviously we didn't get any of that this year so what do i think we are going to see um i think we're going to see one of two things I think Spotlight Sims is a chance. I think it's unlikely. I think it's really, really unlikely we see Spotlight Sims. But there's a possibility. And I think because the Thursday, if we see Spotlight Sims, they're going to be short. They're going to be like TTO challenges. I think they're going to be Spotlight Sims, obviously available the whole year. But I think they're going to be doable quickly. I think they're going to be um, like a 20-hour grind, maybe. Actually, I'm trying to think. We have 24 hours of new cards. Probably like a 15-hour grind, like the Triple Trad Spotlight Sims last year. But basically, that's the thing with these Sims. Is that there kind of has to be... they ha It has to be quick if they release them on a Thursday. Because they kind of have to be done by Friday. Otherwise, there's it's it's going to be tough. It's going to be really, really tough. Um, because, again, they're probably going to want people to have them almost done by the Friday. Because that's when Dark Matters come out. And when the overall reward becomes slightly less hyped. But, um... I don't think it's going to happen. I think it's a slight chance. Another weird thing that could happen 
is all-star moments agendas. I don't think it's going to happen. But I do think all-star moments packs are going to come out. I think we're going to see moments cards being added back into packs for the first time in a long time. Where we see like the all-star game MVPs, the dunk contest winner, and um, other guys that played well in the all-star games. Because we've always had it. Like even if, like, if we go as far back as we can go, obviously, um, let's go back to NBA 2K20. There was no updates, but we got like Kawhi and stuff. In 2K19, we obviously got a whole bunch of them. Like, we used to get the cards on the day, if you guys don't remember. Like, right after the three-point contest, we used to get the cards. Back in, like, seven... I'm not sure if we got them in 17, but back in 18, 19, and 20, literally, they used to come out on the day. Like, you were, I remember one time I was on a night out, and I got a notification saying Diamond Donovan Mitchell is now in the game, which was crazy. But, um... Obviously, all the All-Star moments came out on the Monday last year, whereas... Back in the day, you used to literally get All Star Moments cards. Um, the day it happened, it would be right after the car, right after the event. I kind of liked them being on Monday though. I did kind of like them being on Monday last year purely because it meant that I didn't have to work through All Star Weekend and I could actually go and watch the game. But uh, yeah, that's um, that is pretty much it for what I'm kind of expecting. So. I think we're going to see All-Star Moments on Monday. I think we're going to see something at the weekend. I don't know what it'll be. I think we see something at the weekend. And then tomorrow... Like, there's going to have to be some... Surely there's something tomorrow. Maybe we see, like, an All-Star Challenge. But, like, maybe we end up seeing, say... Instead of, like, All-Star Spotlight Sims... They have like, you know where it's like Hunt for Glory playoff push. So, um, let's look at Tatum. Where it's like Hunt for Glory All-Stars. Like, I know it seems kind of weird, but like maybe. Maybe that's what we see. Play Because we have all these different playoff push. Where we see like All-Stars with different, um, with a whole bunch of different things. So like, one team, it might be all the rising stars. Like we might end up, say, getting like Ruby Amethyst Diamond versions of all the rising stars, which would be something really cool. And then like, say, the all-star players, like we may not get like God-tier versions of them, but I don't know, maybe we got like a, a Pink Diamond LeBron James, who is not quite as good as the Oval, but is still really good. That gets people playing the game. Again, I'm just thinking of just random ideas that I would like to see. Obviously, I don't think it's going to be the case, but, but we can expect something good. Like, I'm just talking about random ideas. Um... If anyone but Sam said this, I wouldn't necessarily be that hyped. And I will say from Ronnie's tweet yesterday, this is some this is huge. Like if you're Ronnie, yeah, it is it's crazy to get your own my team card. I think the celebrities concept was actually huge. And the fact that even though it's not specifically all-stars, um Six Man Sam does say more all-star content, which means that it's considered like an all-star content. It's considered all-star content means, yeah, surely. Surely, um, oh sorry, it says here, stay tuned for more All-Star content. Surely we're getting a lot more other than just the packs. Because again, if if anyone but Sam said it, I would believe that the All-Star content was just the packs. I just, I just think there has to be more. I think there has to be more. They've done nothing with All-Star Weekend up until Wednesday. There's no Spotlight Sims as of right now. I just don't know. Could it be Sims? Could it be a new like playoff push type thing? Could it end up, could it be nothing tomorrow and then grinding stuff coming on Friday? Yeah, it really could. I honestly don't know. But it could be really, really... It could just be really good. It could be a really bad situation where we get nothing, but... I don't know. I'm going to hold on. I'm going to hold on to some hope. So, yeah. um, The dev confirmed there's going to be more All-Star content. What could it be? I think we're definitely getting moments. We're definitely getting All-Star packs Friday. We know that. I think we're definitely getting moments cards on Monday. I would think maybe we get moments cards on Friday and on Saturday. Or see, on Friday, Saturday, Sunday, right after the games. I doubt it, but there's a possibility considering they did it in 2K20, 19, and 18. Um, and then tomorrow is the big day. Tomorrow is the day where we could end up getting something big. We could get a Sims. We could get a playoff push type grind. Um, but I think if it's Sims, we might see it tomorrow. If it's a playoff push type grind, we're definitely going to only see it on Friday. So yeah, that is pretty much it, lads. That's the video. Let me know what you guys think is coming on All-Star Weekend. Like, do you think it's going to be great? Do you think it's going to be bad? Let me know in the comments below. 
Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.